Goddess of Victory, Nikkei. That's right, the collab is out. And I know I'm a day late, a buck short probably, but we're here to talk about this update. And we're here to talk about all the good stuff that's coming with this. Some stuff I wasn't even tracking to actually being here, maybe because I'm a little bit of a moron. It's, it's happened before, right? So before we get into that, let's just admire Marciana, right? Gosh, she's hot. But actually, before we get into that, like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell to be notified when the next Goddess of Victory Nikkei video What's comes out. And of course, don't forget to check out Gamer Subs. Use code TYSTRA for 10% off. Y'all, we have so many content creator, like, stuff that's coming out. It's crazy. <clears throat> and it's so good. I can't wait till I get my cup eventually. I'm working on it. I need y'all's help. I need you to buy more Gamer Subs. I need you to buy it with code TYSTRA. I'm just saying anyways let's get into it so one of the things that i wasn't tracking on right that hit me out of nowhere and i was so confused was the alice diary now i did not know that this was coming right i did i i wasn't tracking to this i wasn't uh now i am tracking to this and we're getting free stuff from it we get a free alice on chapter one and on chapter two we get a ticky right just one ticky right i'll take the ticky right Day three, we have another dicky. That's perfectly fine. I like me some free dickies. We got another ticky right there, right? We get another ticky. And another ticky, right? And then on day seven, guess what? We get another ticky. And then we get another ticky right there. Day nine, we get another ticky. And so on, and so on, so on, and so on, and so on. But some of the other rewards are there too. Like when we get to day 14, these rewards are actually pretty dang good. We're gonna get 50 of these uh, little thingamadoodle bobbers that we use for favorite items, right? Uh, we get a Tetra based helmet, which is mainly for Alice, but if you've already got a helmet ready, which I think I do, there we go. You don't have to worry about that. Uh, we get a uh, enhancement stone to make your equipment a lot better. And of course, more of the, you know, things to Increase your bond, right? And I haven't finished Alice's bond. But to me, this makes me think that Alice might be getting a favorite item soon. That's just speculation on my part. But really, it just seems weird that we're getting an Alice. We're getting all this equipment. These, you know, wonderful things that help with favorite items and stuff. And things to boost the bond, right? So that's just me. That's just how it comes off to me. I, I'm probably wrong. And I've been known to be wrong before, but that's just speculation on my part. I have no idea if that's the case or not. Nikkei, I need you to tell me, okay? I need you to tell me, like, privately. Send me, a, send me a message, right? Now, outside of that, right, we have the costume gacha, which is up for Asuka. And we know that Asuka is the new character that's out. And yeah, I've, uh, I spent a little bit. I haven't gotten the full costume just yet. I do plan on getting it um, because you know what? I, I have a gambling problem and it's really bad, right? <laughs> That's really all I can say towards that. Uh, but yeah, so we already know that Asuka is the first character of, you know, this collab. Now, I ain't going to go into details of how bad my summons were, but you can probably tell by my gem count how bad they actually were. I I need reimbursement. <laughs> I need reimbursement, DK. Shift up, please. Por favor. Por favor. Mi amor. Por favor. I need, I need a reimbursement. Um, but yeah, I... I I got trashed on, but you'll see in the summons. It was, it was pretty funny. Um, outside of that, we also got the new battle pass for another Asuka costume. That's crazy, right? Let's go ahead and check out all the Asuka costumes. I I did end up pulling her. Uh, spoilers alert. Or spo spoilers alert. Spoiler alert. So yeah, we got this costume. We got this. Co we got four different costumes. I just realized that. What in the H? This is the free to play costume that we're going to get, which is pretty cool. You know, and then this one's from the battle pass, right? Which comes with a different little thing. She's going to, yeah, look at this. Look at that. She does a little spray paint, which is pretty sick. And then, of course, this is the gotcha costume, which is pretty dope. The costumes are all dope. I like it. Now, this is, of course, the Neon Genesis Evangelion collab. So, of course, we're going to get Asuka. I already knew that Asuka was going to be the number one, followed by Rey. Uh, I didn't know about Mari, right? Which is what we're going to go over right now, right? So we're going to pull up where it should have the whole update here. It should have the whole booty update, right? 
Um, new characters, Asuka, which is attacker, burst three. Uh, and then, of course, we got Ray coming out uh, next week. I think less than seven days, right? So it's, a, it's she's coming out the 29th, it's the 23rd. So yeah, le six days, technically, right? Uh, then we got Mari seven days after that, which is pretty dang chic, right? Uh, we also got a bunch of other stuff. So we have Union Raid going on right now. I don't think Solo Raid's out right now, if I remember correctly. I think Solo Raid just came out before that. Yeah, so Solo Raid came out before that, but we do have Union Raid out. So if you're not doing your Union Raid, you should. By the way, I think y'all should uh, come and be a part of my Union. Uh, if you need a Union and... You're needing some uh, active peoples. Uh, my people haven't been active today just yet, but we will be. Uh, I'm going to be posting up a message here shortly. But yeah, we do have Void Corp. Go ahead and get in on this, right? Big shout out to Void Corp. Love, the, love those guys. Twink, my boy. That's my boy. I just slapped my tit for no reason, right? Now, I'm kind of all over the place with this, but it's kind of it's kind of difficult for me to keep, keep my head on straight. It's like 4 a.m., right? So, we also got a free-to-play SR Masato from the event, which is uh, something we'll go over here in just a little bit. We have I haven't gotten her yet, but it's from Login Rewards, so. Uh, we also got a temper or, well, we already knew that. Come on now. These are all the costumes. We got two costumes coming out for Rey, uh, and two costumes coming out for Mari. Uh, Leona, surprisingly, is getting her own costume as well because this actual event will play into the monthly battle pass that's coming out in September. So Leona, I I can't wait to see how that looks, right? I, I'm stoked because Leona is hot as it is. And I'm pretty sure if she's coming out like that, it's probably going to be something more mech orientated in my opinion. I'm just saying it probably is because of the fact that we have this whole collab going on. Now, of course, we have You Cannot Evade, which is the new event going on. There's going to be three parts to the story, and we'll go, we'll, we'll dive into that as well, as you can see right here. Three parts, and then challenge stage as well on top of that. We got coordinated operation happening during this as well, and a mini game, which is a battle simulator, which we'll play one round of uh, as we go in there, right? Uh, we also are getting full burst weekend this weekend, so pretty sick. As we go into number two, we talked about Solo Raid. Solo Raid, September 5th. I, I should have read the date, so that's my bad. But we did get Union Raid uh, started. Simulation Room Overclock is going to be happening as well. So if you like Overclock, boom. We're going to be getting Simulation Room Overclock. I'm pretty stoked on that. Arena Reshuffle, which I wasn't tracking to. Uh, I guess we're going to go undergo reshuffling, which is pretty sick. Um, or we are, or no, we're going to on September 4th. Hopefully, I get a room or a, a whole bag of people that are just bad at the game right let me let me get some more rewards just by being as good as i am you know uh, feel pity on me come on <laughs> new ga uh new gameplay uh manufacturer equipment co uh combinator now we're gonna go ahead and take a look at that and it's gonna be exactly like uh you know the this manufacturer arms thing and the stuff that we've been seeing kind of like with our molds and stuff this is it right here so what's going to happen is that you're going to basically every day go to the shop buy the 10 of these right and once you get 100 you could actually uh use it as materials to obtain the specific or selected manufacturer equipment uh you could actually choose which one you want to get first and you could actually choose specifically which one you want so for me I need to look at my Nikkei's because there are some that are missing that specific equipment that I need to make sure so that way they get their four pieces, right? So that's that's really cool. I think that that's awesome because it helps with building your characters that much faster. So thank you, Shift Up, for doing that. Again, massive, massive up, ups to Shift Up right there, right? Pretty sick. Uh, of course, we got the uh, passes that are coming out. Pilot and Summer, Pilot and Summer, Pilot and Summer. We're getting a Ray and Mari pass for the event, which is already kind of understood i figured that that was going to be the case as it is uh anomaly interception actually is tough i i can't beat it i can't beat it i get down i get the like thing down to five bars and i just start getting my butt kicked have any of you actually beaten the boss for anomaly let me know in the comments down below would love to hear if you guys have but honestly anomaly interception i hope that stays it like well not stays like permanently i think it should come back for events and stuff but you get some really good rewards if you get to 
uh, at least near the middle part of five bars from what I've seen. You get like all of your equipment as uh, yellow equipment and you have a potential to get like some extra stones and stuff like that, which is pretty pog, right? I love it. Uh, add a custom lock that can lock uh, equipment modification effects once. Uh, so that's another thing that, they, that they've added, which basically is like, instead of using your stones, right? You could actually like lock the equipment as it is with just that, which I think is pretty sick, right? Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, I forgot to say with Anomaly Interception, you could choose one of five bosses that you want to fight depending on the typings of your characters, right? So that's pretty sick. Uh, I know I keep saying pretty sick, but guess what? I'm going to keep saying it because I love this game. It's pretty sick. <laughs> Custom packages updates, uh, discontinued packages. They they took out some of the packages. Optimizations. Uh, we confirmed an issue with resetting of command center and lobby background music under certain circumstances. It is not including or not immediately reflected in the UI. We have confirmed an issue that uh, where the regenerated bomb moves abnormally after the bomb being carried by the pickup robot explodes in the elevated tile in lost sectors uh which that i was getting confused of because i couldn't grab the bombs during one of my lost sectors uh and i had to like do this little like weird thing where i had to like look at my placement and somehow like grab it when it was invisible but it would grab it then very strange uh yeah it was definitely uh, yeah, yeah sector 10 sounds about right in my opinion now we have also we have continued that the option icon and squad formation does not appear when selecting specific options in overclock under certain circumstances the effect of this option is functionally normal we have identified the cause of this issue and we'll fix it in a future patch and then also pre please refer to optimizations on august 22nd in system notice for other game improvements during the bug fixes so we did get this one right here optimizations and there is a lot of bug fixes the bug fixes bug fixes so i highly recommend that you take a look at that that just kind of goes over the alice diary stuff so let's go ahead and dive into the actual event right this area is cool and i really like this home screen um but yeah this area is kind of cool it's very small so it's a lot easier to find the items that you need to find but yes you get story one the story two will open on 828 just before ray comes out and then of course the third story will come out when mari comes out we have login come stamps on, go. which we're gonna go over here really quick and as you can see misato is going to be the next one that comes well, comes out for the login i'm really happy because misato is the only one that is legal from my understanding and that makes me happy <laughs> like i am not sipping for asuka or ray or mari because mari is unknown right that's just that's just how it's gonna be right uh then of course we got the challenge mode which is pretty normal uh i can't remember who the challenge was i think it's a new or no it, it is freaking uh douchey mcdouche grinder boy you know i hate that guy I hate that guy so much uh and then of course we got the mini game which i'm gonna kind of show you what goes on with this mini game right and we're gonna do like one serious round of this right because i'm on challenge mode we're gonna go into the easy mode just kind of show it off Oh, will it not let me play easy mode that's cringe all right so basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna pick a character or you're gonna pick your character which is oscar right now that's the only one you can get and you're going to fight in this challenge mode and you're gonna basically press the key that coincides with a certain thing it's like a duel almost and i'll, I'll kind of show you what it is i'll keep it on slow because i'm terrible at this anyway so this guy's gonna have only three or two points that you could choose if it's core i press the s key if it's that i press the w key and you can kind of see it as i'm going through this right now as you progress it's going to get more difficult and you can do multiple keys at once so we're going to just keep going and he's going to do that i remember that i remember the pattern i remember the pattern of that guy all right here we go oh i messed up yep i'm gonna take that hit i deserve that i deserve that there we go there we go. Now I'm getting it. Oh, I think I'm good. Nope, I'm good. I'm good. I'm the best. I'm just saying. But yeah, I really dig this event because it's like, it's super easy. It's super easy to understand. Oh, I messed it up. 
Oh, and then you get your burst skill, which is just the burst from Asuka. And it does a significant amount of damage to Cucumber. Alright, I got that combination right. But yeah. Uh, eh, eh, eh. It's the next one that always gets me. I have not been able to get past uh, five because I am terrible at this. Here we go. All right, we're good. We're gonna take that. All right, come on. Oh, I get... What? See what I mean? See what I mean? It just gets me every time. But yeah, that's basically it. Yeah, like laugh at me in the comments. Just laugh at me in the comments. Tell me, tell me how bad I am, right? Because I'm just trash. Who's, who's doing better than me? JMO and Twink? Of course it's those two. I hate them. But yeah, you also got missions that coincide with that. Challenge missions and normals. So I highly suggest that you do these. Because again, you're going to get more uh, stuff to actually power you up. And alongside that, you're going to end up getting, you know, little jemmy poos, right? Little jemmy poos. You also got traits to power you up as you uh, go forward. But it's only going to be through story. So I did the attack ones. Because again, you know, I have an attacker right now. Uh, no Ray, no anything else. So. But yeah, I think that this collab is actually the best collab so far. Not because of the characters per se. Oh, and I got some... Uh, hey, there we go. My union's being active now. Look at that. Look at my union being super active. Um, but this update is good because... It, like, it's... This collab is the best collab. Not just because of the IP, but because of everything that's coming out with it. I was not expecting an anomaly interception and i wasn't expecting it to like make me actually work right i was like oh yeah this should be easy after i found out about it it's not you know and then we're getting simulation room overclock we're getting a reshuffling of the uh pvp arenas and stuff this is a huge win on shift up so big shout out to shift up and goddess of victory nikkei for providing such a great update so let me know in the comments down below what you think about this update i definitely want to hear y'all's opinion once again this is Tyster Daisetsu signing off thank you so much and we will see you in the next video please take care and be safe